Oh hey, I didn't see you there. I'm Austin, welcome to Game Grooves. Today I'll be taking a look at the soundtrack for F-Zero. <laughs> F-Zero is a futuristic high-speed racer on the Super Nintendo. It stars Captain Falcon and spawned a series that is beloved by many, but has largely been ignored by Nintendo over the last several years. While I'm a bit more partial to F-Zero GX on the GameCube, I can't deny that the music from the original is catchy and iconic. You have tracks that have lasted through the series to this day, like Mute City, and tracks like Silence that have a slamming bass line. So when this bootleg went up for sale, I grabbed it in a heartbeat. Yes, you heard me correctly, this is a bootleg release. Nintendo is notorious for its lack of vinyl releases despite having a ton of soundtracks people desperately want. So community members take it upon themselves to do small runs of the soundtracks they most want to hear. And the love that gets poured into these releases is extremely apparent. Let's take a look. This release comes from newcomer Tota Karibo, and was a limited run with 300 copies and no variants. It's a single LP, light blue, with a subtle white marbling. At the center of each side is a comic book style picture of the vehicles from the game. The outer sleeve keeps things simple and elegant, with the front cover sporting pixel versions of the vehicles with winding trails behind them. The back shows more of these trails, as well as a track listing. No frills, just elegance. And at $25, I didn't hesitate to pick it up. Now we gotta spin this thing, so let's take a listen to my favorite track of all, Big Blue. And that's F-Zero. Some people take issue with bootleg releases, but when the company in question seems to have no intention of ever making the product a real thing, and it's a project done with love, I have a hard time arguing against it. I'm proud to have this in my collection. Next time, I'll be taking a look at Fly Rule, A Terrible Fate. See you then.